Welcome to First Bytes. Today we're going to be talking about how character sheets work in Savage Worlds. Here we have some characters already set up. So here's Red Gunslinger. You can see it's got all of your statistics here. There's your fatigue, your wounds, any conditions, your bennies, your attributes, your skills. And then there's a quick access tab. You can star anything on the edges, hindrances, gear, and effects to get these in your quick access. Here are your edges, hindrances, and special abilities. Also, if you want to look at what any of your edges or hindrances do, you can just click on them. You'll find the text there. Here is the gear tab. Again, same thing. Quick access by starring it. Any effects that are on your characters, any actions you want to set up, which we'll talk about in a future video, as well as your advances, your background, and your notes. Now, this is set up for the Deadlands character sheet. This is set up for the official Savage Worlds character sheet. But if you go up to the sheet button, you can select any of the official sheets that are set up in your game's modules. Now the GM can set the default sheet for the campaign, either the official one, the Deadlands one, or in this case, we also have the fantasy one. Now, additionally, you can go to the compendium pack and add any of the archetypes in directly as a character. We'll select the Paladin and import the entry. And now that Paladin is ready to be assigned to a player as a character. 